Good morning, welcome in and welcome back to the channel. How are you guys doing today? So we have a couple of things that's happening. We have a grocery store that is closing and we have two banks that's closing. We're gonna get right into it. Please give this video a thumbs up, share it out and leave comments down below. And I hope you guys have been having a great weekend. So first things first, let's get to the banks. Wells Fargo Company and TD Bank Group each plan to shutter locations in Charlotte, North Carolina area branches, according to the comptroller. San Francisco-based Wells Fargo closed a drive through branch at 5637 Albemarle Road in Charlotte. That location closed on February 7th. According to a spokesperson for the bank, the ATM services are still available there for now. Next, we have Toronto-based bank, TD Bank, that is closing a location at 2609 Mills Park Drive in Rock Hill, South Carolina. That branch will close on April 26, according to the spokesperson. And it is no secret that banks have been closing down for a while now. They are consolidating branches and getting rid of a lot of their brick and mortar, moving more to online banking. So next, we have the Walmart location that is closing down indefinitely, and this is in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Walmart closes indefinitely after a fire that caused $9 million in damage last Sunday. The Burbank Walmart in Baton Rouge is closed indefinitely after a fire this past Sunday, causing $9 million in damages. Officials said the fire happened shortly before 8 p.m. when the St. George Fire Department was alerted of the fire inside the building. When firefighters arrived, the building was evacuated and no injuries were reported. They do believe that this fire was intentionally set. A spokesperson for the fire department said the estimated damages are up to $9 million due to the extensive damage from the sprinkler smoke and flames. Officials said that there are other alternatives nearby for shopping, including Albertsons and Rose's, uh, both on Bonnet Boulevard. So that's what's happening in today's news. I will see you guys later in another video, hopefully a store walkthrough. Please give this video a thumbs up, share it out, comment down below, and I hope you enjoy me giving you a just short snippet of a video today as far as news that you can use straight to the point.